Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Jirabi Therion bringing you. A, what the fuck? What the title screen is even here? What the fuck? I know. Yeah. So, uh, if you guys don't know what this game is, this is called Scarlet Nexus. Yes, I am doing a let's play on this game, on the new game that just released today. It is for like uh, the PS4 mainly, and maybe for the PS5 if you have the right equipment. So yeah, I don't know what to expect from this, like a uh, let's play or like you know like. Uh, what the story or the, you know, the characters have. I've seen this in like the uh, E3 trailers and I've been really interested in this. Yes, yes, I know. As you guys can tell from all the games I've played so far, I'm a fucking weeb. And I'm proud of that. Well, not too proud of that, but you know. But it does feel weird not to see the uh, title screen or anything. It, it just feels so weird. So I don't know what to expect from this let's play or this game, really. I'm just going in blind, just like, you know, I've been interested in this game for a while. I bought it and I'm gonna play it. So yeah, get ready for some, you know, intense stuff, and let's hope this is, uh, worthwhile. Hope this was worth $60. Before starting the game, you must agree to the terms of service and privacy policy. Of course, I gotta do that shit. Please select the display language in the terms of service and the privacy settings. English, Francis, Italiano, Dutch, 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 I don't know, Espanol, Espanol, Litano, Americano, what the fuck is that? Portuguese, Brazilian. Uh, oh, what the fuck? I don't even know what that is. I think that's like Russian or something. Ch no, Chinese, I think. No, no. Uh, yeah, it's Chinese. A different form of Chinese. Don't know what this is. I think this is Japanese, yeah? In English. Alright, English. Yeah, 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 whatever, whatever. I don't care. I don't care. I don't fucking care. I don't, I don't care. Who reads these anyways? Who does? Seriously, tell me. Who reads these? Can I, can I even accept? Oh, I can't. Alright, whatever. Just accept them all. I don't give a fuck. Adjust the brightness. It can be changed later. Adjust the brightness until both the right and left images are visible. Okay, I can't see them, so... What the fuck? I can't see both of them. I won't be, wait, what? Until both the right and left images are visible. I think I'm starting to see this, the other one, but the other one's disappearing. This one's visible. I guess this is good. Nah, just default settings. I'll go fuck. Who cares about that shit? Select the audio language. It can be changed later. English voices, Japanese voices. Okay, so game plan as usual. English voices first. If it's shit, then I'm going to go to Japanese. That's it, game plan. So let, select the game's difficulty. It can be changed later. Normal, hard, easy, normal, hard. Okay, well, uh, I guess, like, hard. Might as well. Ooh. Yeah, it's new game, low game. Options. Analytics. License. Co convert data. Convert data? What does that do? Convert Scarlet Nexus save and system data to the PS5. Oh, okay. Well, I don't have a PS5, so, no. License. Yeah, I don't have that either. Analytics. Yeah, whatever. Not that much of a problem, really. Just play this game for fun. Okay, so difficulty settings, auto lock on, camera tracking, enemy damage display, brain crush animation, whatever that is. Hmm. Okay, well, I don't think it's gonna be that important later. Let's just, like, uh, play the game. Let's get into this already. Fuck, excited. Ooh. Select the story to experience. Oh. I have to choose either the male or the female. I don't know, to be honest. Uh, do these two have a name or not? I, I bet that they do. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll start with the boy, I guess. Uh... Well, I don't know, I kind of like the girl, how, how she looks. But I have a feeling that uh, we're going to like get to a point in this guy's story where, like, uh, oh, we can't progress further until we get into her story, basically. I'm guessing that's how it's going to work. Alright then, let's start with the boy story. 
Yuto Sumiragi. He comes from a great family who are descendants of the founding father. Cheerful and optimistic, he's a young boy with an unwavering and kind heart. Having had his life saved by the OSF when he was young, he was inspired to join the OSF as a volunteer to be able to save others. He fights qu close quarters with a combination of quick sword attacks and psychokinetic abilities. No, oh, psychokinesis abilities. Okay. So, what about her? Kasane Randall. Scouted by the OSF, she was an elite cadet at the academy, always at the top of her class. Of course, a typical anime. Cool, rational, and indifferent to others. The only person she's opened up to is her adoptive sister. She is extremely loyal to her, and she will do anything for her sister, even die for her. She fights at range with a combination of range and multiplayer attacks and psychokinetic kinesis abilities. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna start with the boy story first. Let's do this. Oh, what the? You have to live, no matter what. Man, my mind's going crazy now. Children of the state, powers are more potent when the mind is young. Well, what the fuck? Is this a loading screen? So LSF... Oh, dang it. You're right. Skipped. The virtual brain link cable will now be connected. This will hurt much more than it did in training. Be strong. I don't know if I can skip. Systems all green. Beginning SAS cable connection. Oh, what the fuck? Is this for real? Oh, I'm kind of screwed. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, you're screwed, dude. Nice seeing ya. Listen, pepperoni. Is this even a good idea? What the fuck? This is what SAS feels like. Feels like shit. Good. Seems like you're okay. Yeah, yeah definitely I'm okay. Determine your platoon assignment. Do your best. Yes, sir. And fuck you too for puncturing me with that shit. Alright, alright, hop into the game. All others. Move camera controls. Move with the left stick control camera with... Oh, controlled camera with R. Reset camera with R3. To change camera settings, open the main menu with options and navigate to the configuration screen. Alright. Oh, what the... Camera moves. All of its, all, all of its own. Huh. This looks nice. Though, I feel like our character's like, uh, really going past the camera here. I was like, boom! The camera can't keep up! Ha! Can't catch me, camera! Can't catch me! <laughs> it looks kinda weird, too. It's like, you can just like, dash around and around and around and around and around. This looks funny. This is the final trial. I have to be ready. Stop thinking so much. I have to focus on what's in front of me. Is that techno music? Complete this assignment. I'll be a member of the OSF. Soon, I'll be able to make my childhood dreams come true. Yeah, fucking a girl in bed. That's everyone's childhood dream. <laughs> That'd be funny if this like a uh, game ended up with like Persona Five or Four, where like we get to choose our best girl. That'd be nice. Let me see. Like, can I pause? Okay, only the settings and such. Well, uh, zoom in. Oh, wait, minimap display. Okay, zoom out, I, I guess. Minimap rotation. 
minimap display on. Hmm. Let's keep it keep it as is. Let's just save it. Oh, I can't double jump. That's bizarre. Why are the arrows point this way? Huh, weird. What the fuck? Or is it pointing the other direction? What the fuck? Why is it pointing that way? Tesk is really fucking me up, isn't it? <laughs> this fucking techno music is, is out of this world. Oh, other? Okay, hold R2, Psychokinesis ability. Hold R2 to perform Psychokinesis attack. Consume the Psychokinesis gauge to control surrounding objects and attacks. Okay. Let's keep this up. Huh. Neat. Lock onto an enemy with R3. Press again to disengage. Locking onto enemies is a basic tactic applied in fighting because it is easier to hit your target, obviously. Lock on as soon as you encounter an enemy. Every gamer knows this. Okay. There you go. Neat. Neato. So we're basically like Silver the Hedgehog, I guess. Seriously, what are those things? Others, right? Yuto's battle style. Yuto fights using his power, psychokinesis, and with his sword. The attack range of his sword is short, but he can overwhelm enemies with his fast attack. He attacks enemies one by one at, at a close range. Since weapon attacks with square slightly charges the psychokinesis gauge, he uses a mix of weapons and psychokinesis to dispatch enemies. Hitting an enemy with a weapon attack will automatically lock you onto that enemy. Automatic lock on and target switching can be changed from co config settings in the options with options. Alright. So just lock on. Hey, the dash. Alright, just hit it. Hmm. Okay, this is just the weapon. Ah, it feels a little slow for some reason. Oh, step. Okay, dead. Yeah, so I can do like dodge and everything. Nice. Oh, aerial enemies. Do we have a gun? Give me a gun. There's a chance she would know something about her. I have to make it through this exam, no matter what. All right, so you can lock onto enemies with R3 and change targets with. R1, R. Okay. Like this. Defeat the enemy with a rising slash attack. X plus square. Alright. I guess I can combo into this. Oh, yeah, I can. Oh. What's a scummy Pedro? Alright. No clue. I have no clue what the fuck's even going on. Exam should be finishing up soon. The instructor always said the most dangerous thing is being careless at the end. Okay, so step and then L1 plus circle to dash. Beat the enemy to various different attacks. Hold. Oh, oh, I didn't see you there. Hold R2. Second condition attack. Weapon attack. Okay. Man, he's getting hit all the enemies for some reason. That would be really close to hit him a bit. Come on. There you go. All done. You know special attack. Press triangle while moving to perform a sweeping moving spin attack in a wide area. The second kinesis gate will cover greatly, so, it's ha so adding this to combos allows you to fight while sustaining the gauge. It can only be used once per combo, but learning other skills can increase the amount of times it can be used. Ooh, nice! Okay, so special attack with triangle.
So just like throwing things at it. Rush follow up. Perform a weapon attack with square when landing a second kinesis attack. Hold R2 to do close the distance to an enemy with a rush forward attack. Huh, okay. Ah, there it is. <laughs> Why does they have a, a massive ass? What the fuck? Like, how is this helping me, guys? Like, how is this helping me learn how to, like, fight whatever the fuck these things are? Man, this guy feels really slow, despite being said to be fast. Psychokinesis follow-up attack. When a square or triangle attack lands, performing a psychokinesis attack by holding R2 will result in a powerful psychokinesis follow-up attack. It consumes a lot of the psychokinesis gauge, so restore it by using square or triangle attacks. This will allow you to combo longer. Will do. Man, more of these fucking sluts. Okay, so... Beat an enemy with a follow-up attack while my holding down or two while attacking. Okay. Come on. Get over here. I see. So I had to hold it. Jeez, this feels weird. Like, I have to hit them with it. Okay, it just feels weird hitting R holding R2 while mashing square, so let me see here. Okay. There we go. Okay, I'm getting used to it a little bit. Enhancing Rush Psychokinesis follow-up attacks. Learning the Rush follow-up attack and Psychokinesis follow-up attack skills increase the amount of times they can be used consecutively. Chaining together a rush follow-up attack, a psychokinesis follow-up attack, and then another rush follow-up attack in succession allows you to deal heavy damage. So, follow rush follow-up attack, a psychokinesis follow-up attack, and another rush. Okay, so I gotta chain them up, I guess. I do everything I learned from my training. I should be able to win. I have to. A brawn yawn. Yeah, eat that. Eat ro a bunch of boulders and such. Yep, he's down. Come <laughs> on, I'm liking the combat of this so far. I mean, I just throwing things at them, but you know. It just feels like maybe this could be good. You can view what you have learned in the tutorial sections again from the help screen in the library of the main menu. Options. Make sure to check it for more detailed information about controls. Sure thing. This concludes the aptitude test. You all failed! Miserably! <sighs> can I pause during this actually? Let me check. No, it cannot. That ends your training. You're an official member of the OSF from tomorrow. Cadets now have 24 hours of free time until then. Make sure to get some rest before your duties tomorrow. Understood. God, that was so awesome. But I wonder how, like, uh, the girl's, like, uh, story begins. Can I, like, uh, go back to hers? And see what's up in her story. I mean, I kind of want to, but mm, I don't know. Should I? So City Ryujin Ward, New Himuka Center. Hey, you oh, you're still alive. Nagi, how did it go? Nagi Carmen, I, I have a feeling that I can like uh, stop this auto scroll stuff. I did kind of pretty good. 
kind of good or pretty good. We were looking rough when the SAS cable connected. Oh, that really hurt. It was fine after I got used to it, though. But it, man, it fuck sucked. <laughs> That's so like you. <laughs> so tomorrow will be OSF, just like we dreamed. I can't believe it. Mm. Yeah. What's up? You don't sound very excited. No, I'm just an emo. Me too. Didn't I tell you? I was saved by an OSF soldier when I was a kid. So I wanted to be one as well. But... But what? You're kind of evil. <laughs> Lately, I've been wondering if that's it. The end of my goal. I'm here today because someone saved me. So... I'm wondering if there is a better way to save more people's lives. You can't bear such a big burden like that. People have limits. Yeah, well, I'm the protagonist, so fuck you. Let's do our best at the job we've been given for now. Yeah, you're right. I guess I was just being a little anxious. First, I have to become a real member of the OSF. Thanks. Your gratitude is greatly appreciated, Mr. Yuito. So you're going to report to Sumeragi Tomb later? I hate telling the ancestors every little thing. So annoying. <laughs> well, it's not just that. The Sumeragi Tomb is collaborating with Baki right now. <laughs> what? Baki the manga? Oh my what? god, there's the buff men in here. Family grave. I know it's a tourist spot, but they do things like that? Where the fuck is Yuji Rohama? It's happening more and more. It's something my father decided on. Oh, right. I have to send a message to my dad and brother. Your father won't reply anyway. I know he didn't want you to join the OSF, but man, that's cold. He's yeah, but I don't give a shit. He's at the council. It's like he's not even two-faced, but three-faced. I mean, he's a politician after all. Anyways, yeah, politicians I suck. Only send him simple messages. Oh, this is a poor a see brain message. Brother. What does it say? Good work. You pushed through. A direct compliment from Chief Sumeragi. You're guaranteed a promotion. <laughs> You're making fun of me. My brother's not going to coddle me just because he's the chief of the OSF. Okay, sorry. <laughs> sure you are. If you're really sorry, you'll give me the keychain from the fortune you get from Baki. <laughs> oh right, God, Baki! I'll pull a fortune and give you my keychain. Then you have to help me pick up the ladies. I have a better chance when you're with me. What? That's just me doing extra work for you. It'd be so funny if he got the harem ending and you know, all this, and he just takes all the girls. Yeah, Yoto's. Such a pimp! Brain message. You will receive messages from various people as you progress through the story. You can view messages in the main menu. Library scene. Screen. You can also open the brain message screen directly with R1 and up. Okay. Minimap location map. The minimap is displayed on the upper right of the screen. You can check your surroundings and the objective direction. You can turn it on and off in options. Open with options from the main menu. This button, whatever the fuck it is, I never I never know the name of this damn, damn thing, opens up the location map. Here you will be able to see more details of your current locations than on the mini-map. Next objective will be displayed at the top of the location map. If you're lost, check the location map. Will do. You really do like Baki, though. Kind well, I've never read it as a kid. Like a stuffed animal I had when I was a kid. When you were a kid? Has Baki been around that long? Hey, Baki's a stuffed Has toy. Been. I can just feel his cuteness in my DNA. <laughs> what? You like cute things, dude? Okay, then. Okay, uh, let me, like, uh, fix this thing with the whole, like, uh, auto scroll subtitles. Turn that off, please. I want to, like, uh, you know, breathe in into the story that's happening right now. Brain crush animation normal? Okay, whatever this is. Okay, so library. Yuto Sumiragi. Info. Other suppression for force division... Five six seventh, class. Uh, class ID. Okay, class ID. I guess. Uh, a lot of numbers and shit. Gender male. Birthday January first. Height, one hundred and seventy three kilometers. I mean centimeters. Power psychokinesis. Weapon a katana. Okay. Uh, let me like see the story. 
What's this do? Oh, it's just like, I guess it's like a, um, I don't know what it is, what this is really. Oh, check the main story up to this point. Okay. Equipment, visuals. What are visuals? Hmm, I can change his outfit and everything? Neat. Items, a light jelly, party. I can have th more party members here. Nice. Okay, so, uh, let me like start like the, you know. Checking out what this guy's all about. You toast to me, Rocky. I'm at level one. Psychokinesis. I'm guessing like there's other types of like uh, powers and such other than psychokinesis. I have a lot of attack power, but little defense. What the fuck? Twenty-six defense. I don't know how good defense is in this, in this game. Probably means nothing now that I'm in hard mode. I'm probably gonna die in one fucking hit from every single enemy. Light jelly restores three percent of max HP. A sweet. Oh, whoops. A sweet orange flavored drinkable jelly. Uh, Miho Muramasa. Mio. Miho. Wait, what? Miho. Yo. Mioho. Muram. Muramasa. I don't know. The sword Yuto has used since he was a cadet. The thin blade is light. It's so easy for novices to intermediates to handle in combat. It is engraved with the name of a famous ancient sword. Man, he's such a weeb, dude. Memento Ear Cups, a memento from the person who saved Yuto when he was young. It features a platinum bezel and jewel crafted into red fi filaments. Yuito never goes anywhere without it on his left ear, and it's like a good luck charm that gives him courage. Okay, light jelly. Oh, it's the same, I guess. Oh, okay, it recovers 30% max HP for all enemies. Okay, but allies, I mean. Black Battle Attire Samurai. The OSF has contracts with several manufacturers for uniform production lines, such as the Black Battle Attire series. The Samurai models, functionality, and aesthetics are based on the armor of ancient warriors. Now that I think about it, uh, let me look at like uh, Yuto again. You know what this dude reminds me of? Uh, let me see if I can pause again. This guy really reminds me of like, uh, you know, like Lucia from Punishing Grey Raven. Uh, like, come on, he looks kind of like her, except he's a, a male. It's kind of funny, and it's kind of like, you know, fitting, since Punishing Grey Raven is like, almost like, out in global. Can't wait to play that game. Okay, so, I guess visuals, attachments too. What's a plugin? Can I change a weapons? Nope, cannot. Man, it's like, UI feels a little bit weird, to be honest. Okay, so battle items, weapons, plugin, visuals. Nothing yet, I guess. Story. Okay, prologue reunion. The time has come for the end of the OSF training and enlistment qualification test. Cadet Yuito Sumiragi endured the pain of SAS cables connected and passed his test. Tomorrow, Yuito will be a re real member of the other suppression force. What the fuck is an other? I have no fucking clue. Okay, is there anything more? Oh, oh, there's a lot of fuck info. Jeez, it's like three paragraphs. Okay, uh, let's start. A bright and optimistic boy who is both strong-willed and kind. He is, okay, I've already seen this, I think. Uh, I think. No, no, not the full thing. Uh, he is the second son of the Sumeraki family, descended from the founding father of New Himuka. Okay, so he's basically, basically the special protagonist today, I think. He comes from a long line of politicians with his father, Joe Sumeraki being the current head of the government, and his older brother, Kaito, directing the other suppression force as chief. He was nearly killed by others as a child, but was saved by a member of the OSF. Since then, he's wanted to join the OSF so he could help other people, eventually going through the intense training to become a member. He still takes good care of the ear cuffs he got when his life was saved. He is also a passionate fan of the mascot, Baki, and collects memorial be a, a mem memorabilia for it. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Like Baki is like supposed to be this like a manga that's about like really like you know oddly buff men. Like like have you guys seen the pictures of the uh, Baki characters? They do not look like humans at all. Holy fuck! <laughs> and you're telling me that the Baki of this universe is a fucking like you know like a uh, a little st stuffed toy? <laughs> it's kind of funny and also kind of insulting to Baki. <laughs> wow, this game got balls. I like it. Nagi Karma. Other Suppression Force Division. Same, uh, group. Class ID, same. Wait, this is a class here, or am I going crazy? Gender, male. Birthday, June 5th. Height, 169 centimeters. Power, aerokinesis. Okay, so there are different types of kinesis, then. 
weapon, a chakram. Okay, so basically he's gonna be the Yosuke of the game. A very good-natured boy who is easily elated and always the life of the party. He's known Yuito since they met at the training academy, and they overcame the intense training together with their strong desire and to join OSF. He knows who Yuito's family is, but doesn't treat him any differently and is now his best friend. He's a fanboy who likes star the star quality of the OSF, but has a serious working class background. He gets exasperated by how serious Yuito is, but has a soft spot for him, so they're always together and gay for each other. Mm, man. Yeah, give me that shit game. Fuck the girls in this game. The fucking, like, uh, you know, gay love for each other. Ah, oh, yeah. Mm, that's the shit right there. Okay, so the spray message is here, but I'm not going to see that yet. Enemies. Scummy pool. A pool with coral-like appendage appendages on his upper body. This other has not been observed to consume or absorb brains. What? This differentiates from other pools may be because of coral organs are hindering the absorption process. Unlike other pools, it has not been observed to take in mass amounts of liquid. When it attacks, it will launch its bodily fluids from afar. It is thought that when biopoles and dopopoles are dehydrated for an extended period of time, they will turn into this kind of pool. What the fuck is this game talking about? What are these enemies? <laughs> okay, the slut, uh, whatever this enemy is. Buddy Rummy, a type of rummy often seen holding arms of his own species. When prey is nowhere nearby, it can be seen performing a handshake like action with fellow buddy rummies. They will not let go even after beginning to act on their own again, thus causing one or the other's arm to rip off completely. This is likely why it is often seen holding the arms of other rummies. Sometimes it will slam the arm down for a crushing attack, and sometimes it will swing it while spinning for an attack with greater reach. What the fuck is with this thing? Data, main signing area. Alright, a scummy pendu. A pendu with no observable mouth. It is likely this other cannot, cannot consume brains. Okay, don't know what an other is, but whatever. When it spots prey, it will perform simply charging and projectile attacks from the sky. It can be rarely observed attacking things with no brain, and even off other, 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 others. Yeah, probably should have thought of a better name for these monsters, whatever the fuck they are. It is theorized that this is due to his yearning going unsatisfied, possibly due to his inability to consume brains. It is comparatively lacking in combative skills, and does not pose a serious threat. However, you should be careful not to let this scoured present distract you from other nearby others. Okay, a brawn yawn. This yawn... Uh, what the f... Okay, so there are pools, rummies, pendus, and yawns? I still don't know what the fuck these things are. This yawn crawls through the ground to approach its prey and leaps out with a powerful attack. Although it looks like a creature turns into the ground to liquid and moves through it, data analysis has shown that the other in self is liquefied and sinks into the ground. While it is in liquid form, clairvoyance will be of no use in spotting it. It went into the ground? Never did that for me. Why do I see legs behind it? What the fuck? Like, like sexy legs and everything. Was that always there? But when it peeks from the ground to spit saliva as prey, it can be seen. The light bulb-like appendages on its sides are thought to be weak points. Using invincibility to hide until it has given up and then attacking these weak points could be a very effective strategy. Okay. Don't know what the fuck these things are, to be honest. Alright, brain messages. Okay, Naki Karma. What voice should I give him? Um, not sure. I guess I'll give him the cool dude impression. We're finally becoming official members of the OSF. It still doesn't feel real. Just when I thought all the hard training was over, they threw that final test right in our faces. I was ready to give up so many times, but I managed to push through because I was with you, Yuito. Love you so goddamn much! We're volunteers, so we might really have our work cut out for us. But I'm looking forward to serving with you as a member of the OSF's 567th class. No problem, dude. Alright, so this is, this is a report. Okay, so Yuito Sumiragi, what should I do with him? I think he had, like, a, a lower voice, so, okay. The final examination is over. Tomorrow, I'll be the official member of the OSF. I'll do my best. Kaito Sumiragi. Is that his, like, father, or is like... No, it, it's his brother. Okay, so... Uh, okay. Maybe a deeper voice, then. Or maybe the Dante voice. Let me do that. Good work. You pushed through. Nothing more to say. Thanks, brother. Okay, so... Is there a map I can use? How do I see the map? There's gotta be a map somewhere, right? Uh, 
Look at that. Oh, there it is. Oh my goodness. This place is big. So there's the objective from the left. Save point and a shop. So, Sui City, Ryujin Ward. Main Street, Sumiragi Tomb Grounds. Alright, just two places. Is there like, like a... I got an explanation? Nope. Hmm, okay. Just this is it. Reset. Okay. Seriously, it feels like we're not moving fast enough, to be honest. Maybe it's just my imagination. Oh, it's a lot of people to fucking talk to. Wow. Alright, uh... Are you a boy or a girl? I think you're a boy. I'm gonna assume you're a boy. <laughs> Troop member who was a new connect cadet. Hey, cadet. Glad to have you aboard. Honestly, I'm just happy I'm not the only very bottom rung anymore. Well, actually, I'll probably die tomorrow. So, see ya. Yeah, see ya, dude. Hello there, dude. Watchful father. Machines exchange a lot of information when they're operated with abilities. And one of the byproducts of the exchange is the neon light you can see. Neon light? This thing? Huh. Okay. Pretty advanced place this is. Looks kind of like... It looks kind of weird in the distance. Like, uh, that bridge over there looks like kind of drawn. Or like, I don't know what the style this is. Hello there, little boy. Hey, did you know? Apparently they call that red light neon. I love the neon you can see from here. It's so pretty. Okay, so I can see who can who I can talk to. Is that a boy or girl? A uh, boy. Where the fuck are the females? What the fuck? <laughs> I, I, I am detecting a very lack of females in this anime game. What in the fuck, developers? Give me some anime girls. Urban myth enthusiast. Hey, have you heard the rumors about the final station of the abandoned subway? Some reckless idiot stuck down in the abandoned subway and said he saw a big um, ammonite. What the fuck's an ammonite? No clue. I have no- I don't- I don't know what the fuck's going on in this game. <laughs> this game's so fucking weird. Veteran true member. How are you feeling? I say it's a boy or girl. I think it's a boy. How are you feeling, cadet? If you're, if you're a volunteer soldier, never let your guard down in the real battle. Sometimes there are strong others who are actually who actually eat OSF members. Although you won't ever encounter major others like that. Well, you're the protagonist, so you'll probably end up killing the other god and just like you know save the world. That's how you see roles in these animes. All right, another dude. What the fuck? Oh, a cadet, which means you were scouted. Oh, you're a volunteer soldier, and you were still able to make it in. That's amazing. You look kind of like a pussy to be honest. Hey, fuck you. I couldn't do that. I don't have any powers that would let me become a volunteer soldier. Give him hell for me. What, you need special powers to do this? Ah, finally a female! Funk fucking less! Oh my god, you have glasses too. Please marry me! Sightseeing woman. I came to a Eugen ward to meet for the Scarlet Guardians. Aren't you with the USF? I can't believe I met one already. I went by the Zumiragi tomb as well. You just go straight. Wait, you already know where it is? Yeah, I have a map. Ah, finally a female. Holy shit. Holy shit, a female in an anime! What the fuck? I'm sorry, guys. I, I'm sorry. I, I know it's weird that I'm making a joke, but, like, seriously, I, fought, I talked to, like, all of these people, and that was the first female that I ever talked to. I know there are, like, females here. Yeah, finally a female. Oh, she looks kind of cute. Hey, what's this poster here? Wait a minute. Is that Elise? Elise, what the fuck are you doing in this game? Oh, that cone just like, just moved with me. Hey, what's this? Tips. There are locations where you can find, obtain items. What, what the fuck did I just pick up? Environmental data, some type of item. Oh, I got an item? What is it? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. What, what did I just pick up? Okay, whatever. The game's not gonna explain shit to me. Right? Not right now, anyways. Have I talked to you yet? I don't think it did. Arisen fan. This Ari- Oh, Arish- Ar Arashi. Okay. This Arashi vision poster is awesome. I want the data. I wonder if I can find it anywhere. Okay, so I'm guessing her name is Arashi. My friend looked for a poster of Major Kyoka, but she's not in the charge of the PR like Arashi. Okay. Don't know who that is. 
Okay, it's a safe area here. Yeah, I got up to this dude to save for some reason and, and shop too. I'm just gonna explore a bit more. Explore. Oh wait, there's something here. Okay, what is this green option here? You can manually save by talking to- Oh, well, I missed that. Okay, what is this thing? Okay, it's an item. Okay. Thank goodness. I just didn't know what I picked up. <laughs> it's just, like, walk, run is, like, a little bit weird looking. Like, what the fuck? It just looks like he isn't running. Like, how- I, I don't- I'm pretty sure that's not how you run, dude. Man, how big is this place? What the fuck? Alright, these two girls. Passionate Sito fan. Do you think that Step Septentrion Monthly should have more features of Captain Sito? Oh, uh, well, that's so confusing. I mean, he might not stand out quite as much as Karen or Fubuki, but he's but he's the most diligent member of the Septentrions, probably. There's a lot of like uh what names in this thing. Fubuki fan. Did you already read the latest issue of Septentrion? Hopefully, the special feature of Kabuki was amazing! Hmm, okay. Can I, like, cross the street? No, I cannot. I have to, like, wait until I get to another cross rock. It's not like, uh, you know, like, uh, Astral Chain, where it's just, like, uh, go into the streets and just, like, you know, fuck up the traffic. That was so funny in that game. Okay, so there's another person here to talk to. I'm just exploring this place. I don't even care about the, uh, you know, the main mission. I just want to talk to people. Man who looks like... Oh, okay. Man who looks at it ads. Hmm. You look kind of weird. These ad and guide visions are displayed using power through Synet. I actually heard there are people who don't have abilities. In that case, does that mean they can't see visions? I have no clue what the fuck this world even is. Like, so far, like, uh, I'm literally liking, like, how this game looks and everything, but... So far, like, a criticism I'm having is that they're not doing a good job with the world building. Like, introducing to this world that I'm in and everything. Like, come on. Give me something, game. What the fuck is going on? And what's this place? Hmm, no clue. Got an item, though. MK1. What does that do? Oh, Force Field MK. A fairly in inexpensive defense enhancement plugin. Fairly increases defense with an invisible barrier. I guess this is like a uh, temporary power enhanced MK1. Fairly inexpensive power enhancement plugin. Fairly enhances the user's power. Uh, I guess. Oh yeah, it has like unloaded versions of these. Yeah, definitely like a uh, like a. Uh, it's a temporary buff or something. <laughs> like I like how you just like uh, knock over bicycles and shit. Just like yeah, I can be an asshole. Just like run over all your bikes. Oh yeah, feels so good. Vandalism. What the? F I'm just like running all over the place. It's so funny. Ah, oh, yeah. Running over bicycles and shit. Oh man, it felt good. Who else wants to talk? Oh, it's a girl in a business suit. Woman working. Look at that sign at. You realize that Suo, -E, Suo, Suo, I guess, is a metropolis. Seirad is a pretty big city too, but it seems so rural compared to Suo. Whatever the fuck that is. World ability. What is that? Alright, so someone here wants to talk? I guess on the bridge or something. There he is. I think he, yeah. Man waiting for broadcast. Did you see the drone broadcast of the other suppression? There's no way we can go out ourselves, so we really owe it to the drones. Oh, are you with the OSF? I always watch the broadcast. Thank you for everything you do. I haven't even done anything yet. Hey, little, little kids. Talk to this calm child. There are so many different types of powers. I think there are a lot of important powers like transfer abilities and teleportation that don't attack enemies directly. And you, little girl, the admiring child. The Scarlet Guardians are so cool! I wish I had cool powers like the power to burn up everything and freeze everything too! I wanna kill everyone! This girl needs help. I'm gonna call 911. Okay, this is a mother, right? This is a mother. Shopping woman. You can buy most things on site and have it delivered to by drone. But some of you actually feed your kids. You want to see in person before buying. I'm just glad I was born in Suyo. It's a good place! Yeah, good place. And this dude. A cautious band. We evaluate the public shelters when the others evade. 
but apparently there are people outside the city who own their own shelters. I think they're called evacuation units or something. Well, there's hardly any people who need to step outside the city. Oh, well, it's fuck, I guess. I guess. I don't know. Alright, now it's a girl and a boy. Monsters that come from... Uh, wait, do all these girls have the same hairstyle? I just noticed. Like, it feels like they all have the same, same hairstyle. What the fuck? Worry woman. Monsters that come from the extinction belt eat human brains, and you can only be defeated with powers. Why human brains? That's still all we really know about the others. <laughs> about the... <laughs> it just feels weird just saying others. I'm, I'm sorry. The, the name is... The name of that monsters is just stupid. I know it's all so normal now, but it scares me sometimes. We're all gonna die! Okay, you might want to help out your girlfriend. Carefree guy. You don't... You don't really need to worry about the others too much when you're in the city. I checked the others' forecast, but when I got here, there were OSF soldiers and shelters all over. But still, there's a chance we might die. Oh well. Ooh, another item. 100 money, I guess. Okay, uh, I think there's another person here. Okay, oh, I can run into people. Can I? I want to run into people. Let me run into people. Let me run. Oh, come on. Really? You're not gonna let me run into people? Really? Really, game? Let me be an asshole, okay? I'm already vandalizing, like, the, a lot of these, uh, cones and bicycles and everything. Let me ram into people. Come on. That would have been so hilarious if I actually rammed into that dude. Oh, my God. Oh, there, dude. Dude, yeah, dude. Simuraki Tomb Worshipper. I know you'd want to cross here to go to Simuraki Tomb, but you need to use the ped 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 pedestrian bridge over there. Man, you're so good at, like, pronouncing words, Drabi. Shut up, guys! Another item. White jelly. And there's another girl here. It's still more posted than that uh, little girl. Kyoka fan. I'm looking forward for a vision poster of Major Kyoka, but there's nothing but Arashi. Man, what is it, Kyoka? Okay, one light jelly. Man, there's a lot of stuff here. Seriously, this is a pretty big city. I think that's everything, though. Right? Yep, yeah, that's everything. I wonder if these, like, uh, items, like, respawn or something. I bet they do. Alright, hello there, dude. Let me save. Satori the Activist. I am air and shadow. Read the brain message carefully for the details. Okay, you were a bit weird, but okay. Save and data. Thank you. So I just read this, right? Save your memory. Satori the Activist. I am the recorder for your platoon. A recorder has the most sacred mission. We observe the mission of the frontline troops and record proof that OSF's troops are performing their duty. You just need to look into my eyes. I will read the necessary information from your brain. You can say my power is very suited for this role. Also, my beloved ride that keeps me mobile, the Motoi bike, can access the shop. The shop is my side job, so feel free to patronize it all you like. Finally, a recorder must remain unbiased and independent. We are not allowed to talk freely with our recording target. Just act as if I am not here unless you need to record or save. I will shadow you wherever you go. Do not try to interact with me beyond my job. That is, that is the best for both of us. Fare thee well. Okay, this is, this is, this, what the fuck? What in the fuck? This world has so many weird stuff in it. Shop. You can buy or sell battle items and equipment at shops. Content available with add-on will be marked with an asterisk. Okay. So light jelly. I already have this, so yeah. And uh, force field MK, a power enhancer, a health boost MK1, fairly expensive health enhancement plugin, barely enhances users HP. Okay, well I don't, I don't think I'll need this now, so yeah. Thanks though. Fare thee well, peasant. Yeah, yeah, whatever, whatever. National Defense Force fan. Generally, the Scarlet Guardians are more showy and popular, but the National Defense Forces are nice because they're like the unsung heroes. They might not be able to fight against others, but it's the National Defense Forces who protect order in New Himuka. A lot of Japanese things, right? Oh my gosh. I know this is a Japanese game, so what the fuck? 
Who the fuck are you? NDF soldier on guard duty. The guard next to me really looked up to the OSF when he was a kid, and he took it pretty hard when he couldn't get in. Please cut him some slack if he lashes out at you. Hey there, dude. I'm an OSF member. Fuck you. Hope you, hope you choke your dick. Are you a new OSF cadet? We are the National Defense Forces. Don't get in the way of our mission or else I'll kill you. Well, I can't kill you because you have the powers of God, which I don't. We don't have the powers like the OSF, but it's the National Defense Forces that protect Suyo from everything excluding others. That's a nice job, dude. Hope you do well in your job. Fuck you. Piece of shit. Get the fuck out of my face. I hope the god you die because your corpse fucked. You have a nice day too, sir. Sumi Rocky Tomb Grounds. Alright, let's go. It's about time I did, did something other than walk around and such. Now, I should be able to, like, uh, not deal with autoplay. Ooh, neat. There are a lot of people paying their respects. Okay, now the auto score isn't happening. Huh, those two girls over there were cute. What? Really? I didn't see them. Dude, Yato, keep your dick in your pants, please. I can't believe your family grave is a tourist spot. You sure are an elite. Oh, Naki. Hello, was brother, Yato. But I'm not. It's like one of those grand families. Your father is the chairman, and your brother is chief of the OSF. Can you please stop talking about my family for fuck's sake? I have, like, really, really, like, uh, issues with them. Plus, you know, like descended from Yakumo Sumeragi, our founding father. He's the hero who saved humanity from the spring of extinction. Dude, I don't even know what the fuck's going on myself. Can you please slow like. down? Maybe he looked like you. He is your ancestor. Maybe he is me. He's my ancestor, but that was two thousand years ago. I certainly don't feel like his descendant. But I probably will be at the end of this game. The only That's how this works. Is in that mask. Even if they say he's my ancestor, how could I be sure? Wait, this, this was two thousand years ago. So we're, we're like well, two thousand years into the future. I don't, I don't know. Ah, uh, I get it. He does look like the villain in a horror movie. His face was injured in the spring of extinction, right? Oh crap! Your dad would get mad at me for saying that about our country's forefather. It's no big deal. Well, he probably will kill you, but yeah, it's no big deal. But you are. The Sumeragi house is known for having lots of authority. Your dad got mad when you said you didn't want to be a politician or a bureaucrat. Enough about my family. Let's go get a fortune from Baki. Yeah, let's come buff. To your ancestors? Okay, let's get going then. Okay, got it. Let's look at the same time. Roger. These are the fortunes that will decide our fate in the OSF. Ready? Ready? Go! And they just like open up their like fortunes and it just says, You are both going to die. The end. Um, Yuto, I feel like we made a big mistake. Yeah, I know, Naki. A big mistake. Very bad luck. <laughs> yeah, I know, you're both gonna fucking die today. You guys, die today. This is a bad sign. Oh, I'm dying. Let's go to a cafe or something after we tie these off. Yeah, we already got Baki's keychain. Why don't we head to Vision Town? Obtain Baki keychain. Reply to brain messages. There are messages that you can reply. If you reply with X, you may receive a reply as well. Some messages will have a time restriction on the reply. Okay then. Isn't SAS awesome? Okay. SAS is really amazing, isn't it? Even though it's an imaginary link, brains link up together and share powers. Actually, what did ASS stand for anyway? I know I learned it, but I already forgot because I'm an idiot. Strong something system or something? It's struggle arm system. Oh yeah, Nagi, you should make sure to protect... It had... Ah. Jeez, couldn't figure out what this is. 
its struggle arm system. Oh yeah, Nagi, you should make sure Protect has been applied to your thoughts. If Protect is off, your Link partner will be able to hear everything you think. If Protect is off, your Link partner will be able to hear everything you think. Like, if you just happen to think something is cute or something, or how, you know, you wanna, you know, penetrate a woman's pussy and everything like you always fucking say every single night we drink together. What? That's terrifying! Absolutely awesome and terrifying! Now I'm really not sure about this whole thing. SES might be more trouble than it's worth. I'll have to be careful. Hehe. <laughs> oh my god, Naki, you're such a handful. Okay, so should be another item here, I think. There it is. Health boot boost MK1. Hit by some of these vending machines. No, it cannot. Okay. Another dude. Passionate worshipper. The founding father, Yakumo Sumeraki. A great man who built the foundation for everything that made our new Himuka. This year, March 2020. <laughs> what? The, the solar calendar year. But did you know that it was Yakumo Sumeraki who created the solar calendar? On the year there were everything worth the shit? <laughs> oh my god, really? Is that a year ago? Wow. Woman seeking collaboration. I'm so glad that they still have Bucky's limited edition keychain. We can be so buff! Mm. Fortune pulling woman. I get the best rating with the Bucky collaboration fortune telling. Plus, I got a keychain. This is the best! It's so cute and buff! I'm sorry, I keep making the Bucky joke, but seriously, I should have. <laughs> what the fuck? Bucky, of all things. Man slacking off. I heard this from a friend in the Serene National Defense Force. Do you think it's true that there are a lot of OSF members who have been killed in action? He said he would get orders not to tell many people, including the deceased family. It's just a rumor, though. Yeah, they're all dying. They're all dying getting their brains eaten. By the zombie others! Should just call them zombies, to be honest. Then this game would have been a zombie, like, game, and it would have been boring. Just like every other zombie genre. Including Last of Us. Alright, so where is this, like, other... You know, place you go. Okay, that way, okay. Let's get a move on. Fuck you, bike. What's this thing over here? A psycho coffee. Psycho coffee? You guys sell coffee here? Psycho coffee? What, you like to lift it with your mind and just drink? That is so fucking weird. What the fuck? Why does my voice keep cracking? Uh oh. Huh? Others? We're all gonna oh, die! Weird. But today's forecast said the threat level here was zero. Not today, bitch. We're gonna fight. What the fuck are those? What are they doing in the city? All units, double time! Yeah, it's gonna, you're not gonna do much, isn't it? Oh, it's actually doing something. You guys are actually useful. That's a surprise, and you're also dead. A transfer warning. They're deploying the Scarlet Guardians. Are we just gonna walk, stand around. I guess we are. Yeah, the only dudes who don't have helmets on. They're probably important. <laughs> oh, that's them. Are they both men or female? One female. Second Regiment Commander. Oh, damn it. Fubuki Spring. Yeah, I guess it's a, they're both men. Karn Regiment, Fubuki Regiment, Plan A, roll out. Civilians, head to the shelter. Huh? Wow. Hey, Yuito, we have to get to the shelter too. We're not real soldiers yet. Now, fit fuck that! I wanna, I, I wanna play the game, please! Let me play the game! Yeah. God damn it, Yuto! I wanna play the game. 
Director, I'm begging you. Brave message. I'm gonna read the message now, during an alarm. Hold on, this isn't right. A rate level zero forecast is obviously some kind of subterfuge. Get yourself together, Director! Fucking idiot! No reply? Okay. Considering it's a forecast, you should be prepared for it to be incorrect sometimes. Stay vigilant. Yeah, no. Just like you right now. Shut up. I wonder if there's anything here. Nope, I can't go through it. Go anywhere else, I guess. Man, that's a mouthful. Hyper-velocity evasion into an electric blast? Why are they just like gawking at the, at this during an emergency? Karin Travers is the only one who can use that many powers. He's so cool. Doesn't he have the ability to copy other people's powers? Wow, that's kind of broken. Yeah, that's why he can use all those powers. It's basically cheating. <laughs> yeah, no cheating in the within the plot. <laughs> Like that is nothing against a Septentrion class. Mommy? Look out! Hey, are you serious? We're not real soldiers yet. Then fuck you, Naki. We gotta help them. We're the only ones here with the powers necessary to fight the others. We can't let me play the game. The instructors find out. We can't just watch people die. I'm going. You call for backup. I don't want to go alone. I'll go with you. Better not be useless. Thanks. I swear to God. Ugh, don't look so happy. It's not like I want to go. Baka. You're the best. Yeah, let's make out later. I don't know that. I'll take the right. You take the left. Got it. Okay. Nope. Okay, why am I not hitting them? Oop. Oh, that almost hit me. Dialogue is displayed on the right of the screen when you defeat an upgrade. Defeat you see an XP item, you earn. See, okay, whatever. Okay, whatever the fuck are you doing? Dead. It's not safe here. Get to a shelter. Y yes, sir. Be careful. There are more others. Can you keep fighting? No, nope, I'm already dying. Sure, why not? I'll take them on. Okay, let's go. Wait, are you even in my party? I don't think you are. I'm just by by myself. Use item. The item menu is displayed on the bottom left of the screen during battle. Left and right to switch items and use down to use them. You cannot use an item immediately after another. You will be you will be able to use another item after a certain amount of time has passed. Really? Okay then. Ow. No, you're not helping me. I'm dying right here, right now. Your ass is over somewhere else. Man, the thing has a really like, lo like slow cooldown. I swear to God, this guy's like uh, speed is just so slow for like a fast like you know sword user. But sometimes my attacks just like go through the enemies. I don't know what the problem is. I feel like it's just better just like uh hitting them with this stuff. Oh fuck. That hurt. Oh what? Perfect dodge? If you dodge an enemy attack at just the right time, you'll perform a perfect dodge. This grants you a temporary vulnerability, giving you an advantage in the battle. Learning certain skills will allow you to recover your second kinesis gauge by pulling off a perfect dodge, or follow one up with a deadly attack. 
Okay. Oh. All right, he's a... He's a... Yeah. God, this thing... Okay, it just feels like this dude's, like, uh... Okay. Okay, getting it a little bit. Alright, jeez. Pool type suppression, plus two. Okay, jeez. Sorry, that was a bit... bit of a handful. Okay, so, health boost, MK, got that. Other ecology. Data acquired by observing and others' ecology. This is exclusively surface level observations and is low value compared to other data. Other ecology A. Data acquired by observing others' ecology. The information is highly valuable and is included rare as it includes rare data that is rarely observed. Pool type suppression plus. Detailed data acquired by suppressing a pool type other. This data has been carefully analyzed by the category, including type traits and battle conditions, and therefore contains highly valuable information on pool others. Okay, and a Baki keychain. A keychain for Baki, the official mascot character for New Himuka's land lauded city computer Akihabara. Arahabaki. Yuito is a big fan of the character, and he looks to complete his keychain collection one day. One day. Not today, though. It's gonna be a boss, isn't it? Was Sorry, it's always a tutorial bass boss. Oh! What the? Well, that came out of nowhere. Ah, he dead. What even is the are these things? They just look so weird. Yeah, eat car. That's odd. You a civilian? Oh, it's a girl from four. It's her. You have to live, no matter what. You're OSF? Okay, so I guess like if we did her story. We would be at this spot then? I guess so. Oh, no, I'm a cadet. I see. Either way, our goal is the same. What do you mean, goal? Are you an idiot? Yeah, I kind of am. Huh? Shh, something's coming. Huh? What's coming? Oh, hello, beefy dude. Here we go. Huh? Okay. Oh, we're fighting with her now. Another appeared. The withered Sabat. You can use brain talk. Do you see what's happening? Let's talk after Ow. we take out the others. Not yet. Oh, there's a certain range to this now. God, get out of the way! Yeah, just dodge and get out of the way. Oh, good for our charge. Seriously, my attacks just aren't hitting these enemies with some out. Ow. Jeez. Okay, 
There we go, you're dead. It's done. Good work. That should take care of all the other readings around here. Yes. She looks kinda of dead inside to be honest. Kasane, I saved that boy. Nagi, you're okay. Yeah, Naomi saved me. Man, I must look like an idiot. Well, technically you are near Nagi. Hey, fuck you. I'm just glad you're not hurt. Who is this? Thanks, sis. Oh, sis. Oh, you two are sisters? You look nothing alike. Yeah, we know. We're adopted, I guess. They're both OSF cadets like us. Let me introduce myself. I'm Nagi Carmen. This is Yuito Sumeragi. I'm Naomi. Naomi Randall. Naomi Randall. This is my younger sister. Yeah. So oh, sorry, I forgot. What the fuck? So it was you making all that trouble. The Scarlet Guardians have eradicated the others. Scarlet Guardians? Is that us? Huh? You saved Ryujin Ward in that amazing victory over the others. What? Well. Oh boy. What is this? A victory interview? It is. How do you feel? Filming for today. Who is this girl? Oh, a Rashi Spring. Oh, that's the girl from the posters. Oh, Captain Rashi Spring. Just who are these rookies? What? Nagi? Huh? Where is everyone? Huh? What the fuck? What's happening? We should be able to talk here. Uh, what the fuck? Uh, what's going on? <laughs> this is exactly what I've been asking the entire fucking game. What in the world is going on in this story? Just, just tell me, game. Just tell me. I'm Luca Travers. Luca Travers, Strike Force member Septernet Yoki. You're Septentrion 6th class Luca Travers? It's embarrassing when you put it that way, but yes, that's correct. Are you all cadets? Please open your personal ports so I can confirm your identities. Have I heard this guy's voice that before? I feel like it did. Luca Travers, registration number, blah blah blah. Is, re re is requested connection. Permission connect. Permit connection? I guess so. Permitted connection. No objections? Thank you. So all four of you are OSF cadets. Cadets aren't allowed to fight others. I I'm sorry. Isn't OSF responsible for allowing others to enter the local airspace and putting civilians in danger? Yeah, you guys suck at your jobs! Kasane! You shouldn't say something like that. Nothing but the honest truth. Those are some harsh words. But you're right, Cadet Kasane Randall. I feel like I heard this guy's voice after somewhere I don't know. I'm sure you all have something to say. But first, report to OSF headquarters. No, I gotta, like, uh, you know, check out the voice actors of these characters. I might know them. Keep away from the press. Got it? Understood. What's that? Oh, casualties from the battle. Two OSF troopers on guard duty were killed. It did. Censored, but it's best not to look too close. Yeah, censored for us to see. It's like, what even is this now that I think about it? Like, I haven't commented on this for a while, but I, I, I don't know how to feel about this whole slideshow stuff. Huh? Why? Because others eat human brains. Yeah, they eat their brains! Their brains like zombies! Yes. Looking at headless bodies can have negative lasting effects on your mental health. Well, we're all screwed then. Because we just saw it. Oh, 
I just imagined it. They should teleport or report them out. It's too far to the morgue, and powers aren't omnipotent. We have time, so let's talk a little. I'm sure you know, but one person can only use one type of power. But each kind of power has peculiarities and aptitude. Just as there are types of powers, each person has strengths and weaknesses. To use them in combat, we must rely on devices to lessen the stress on the brain. That's why things that can be accomplished without powers, or things with low priority, are done manually. Right, sorry. So basically we're all a bunch of weird psychics, okay. Now then, I'll be going. Hello there, okay, goodbye then, Mr. Expedition Dump. That's what you were at this moment. Get the others first. I wouldn't let that happen. We're all 567th class, right? We'll stick together and become great fighters. Nah, I doubt it. Y yeah. I mean, I think, I don't know, like, are they our party members? Because how, why would there be a branching path for Kasane's story? Don't worry. I'll protect you, sis. Let's go. Yeah, fuck these men. Oh, goodbye, Yuito. Nagi. That girl, Kasane Randall. She looks surprisingly like... Her. Those two. From the registration numbers, they're in the same class. Are they twins? Why the fuck did you think that, Yoito? They have the different hair colors. The fuck? She's so cute. <laughs> yeah, of course, Nagi. Huh? Naomi, she's so my type. Wait, what? The type that'll just, like, step on you? Yes, that type. Mm. Please step with me more, Naomi Senpai. Kasane is pretty, too, but she's a little scary. Oh, wait. Naomi is like her opposite. Shy and kind. Oh, I thought she was talking about the, the white-haired girl. Okay, Kasai was a white-haired girl. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. It, it's just, I'm just getting used to his names, guys. She kept glancing at me and blushing. Man, this might finally be my big chance. I'm pretty sure that was just her looking at me. Because I'm a pimp. You're as simple as always. Whatever. Let's hurry to headquarters. And you're also a potential simp, too. Fuck you, Joito. Just you fuck you. Whatever? You should be supportive when your best friend is in love. Yeah, I don't really care. Yeah, yeah. Tell me all about it later. Let's go. Alright. Brain points BP. You gain brain points BP when you level up. You can learn various skills by spending BP on the brain map screen in the menu. Turn. Yep. Thankful censor for censorship. Received brain message. Okay, this one, right? Okay, Nagi Kamen. I've never been more thankful for my vision censorship than I was today. Thanks to that, I didn't have to suffer the mental trauma of seeing those dead bodies. Oh, was that what that was? Like, they saw it, but it was censored? Like, the, like the brains were censored? Oh, that's kind of scary, to be honest. As a member of the OSF, you'll be seeing more dead bodies, I'm sure. Nothing is more important than floating out things you don't need to see. Wait, but does that mean you won't be able to see tits and boobies? Oh, that's right. Yeah. Oh, man, it's gonna suck. Kasane and Naomi, judging by their names, I guess they're pretty cute. Yuito, you like Kasane, right? I saw you checking her out. Hmm, you gotta have some hot sex later? No, Nagi. You always do this to- Oh, he's talking. He's gonna talk. You always do this to me, Nagi. It's not like that. I was looking at Kasane because she reminded me of someone. The girl that saved me when I was little. Oh, you mean the girl that made you want to join o OSF? Maybe you should ask Asani about it. She might be able to enlighten you if you n catch my drift. Shut the fuck up, Nagi. Just shut up. <laughs> I'm sorry, Nagi is such a funny dude. I mean, a bit weird, but funny. Okay, so where should I go next? Uh, Whoopsie. Did I want to do that? Yeah, I have to go back here, I guess. First, let me see the shop, then. What's in the shop? What can I buy? Nothing new. Okie dokie. Sell, accept. Oh, I didn't really do much in the demo, so I have nothing from it. And save, I guess. I am air and shadow. Read the brain message carefully for details. Oh, -ha. I swear to God, this guy's just so fucking weird. So, anyways, guys, I think that's a perfect time to end this episode off. Okay, I have. I am not sure what to feel about this game so far. So far, I, I like the combat. It feels pretty interesting and everything. 
But overall, it's like I'm still like wondering what in the world is even going on. It feels like like I don't know. Like should I have gone into like a Kasane's like route first to understand what even is happening in the world? Because I feel like that's what I should have done to be honest. Because I'm I'm not sure what Kasane's route even does. But I do know that like there's gonna be moments where we're gonna meet Kasane during this route. And I feel like the same is gonna happen in Kasane's route for you know like uh. Beating up with uh, Yuito. So I don't know, like, uh, I'm gonna let you guys, like, uh, comment down below and, like, uh, try to give me advice on this game, because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, to be honest. But if I really need to, like, go into Kasane's route first, then Yuito's, or I'm not, I'm not, just, I'm just not sure. I'm just, not, I'm just don't know. So overall, like, I'm really liking this game. I, I like the, you know, the art style, you know, it's anime and such, which is, uh, you know, kind of stuff that I like to play and everything and it's also like a uh, Yuito like he looks pretty cool he looks kind of like uh you know the Punishing Grey Raven character like Lucia I think, I think that's her name and yeah like the uh you know like this whole like place looks just looks fantastic so far I do have like a few criticisms though like the world building is like not good to be honest it just isn't so far I don't know what is going on I don't know what the others are, I don't know what the state of the world even is, I don't know if we're in an apocalypse, I, I have a feeling we're in an apocalypse because the others eat people's brains and such, and there's gotta be a reason for that, maybe the others like, uh, you know, like, uh, want the psychic connect abilities of humans or, or something, I don't, I don't, I don't know, I don't know. The second thing is that, uh, I think the story so far is like, it feels like they're in, like, Informing us about like a uh, Yuito's like a uh, history and you know her his family in such an awkward way like uh you know like uh if there's one thing that drives me so much is when like uh characters like two characters you know they have a conversation with each other and they tell each other the very thing that they should know you know like uh how like Nagi told him like, Yuito about his family they're like wait. But you're his friend, like, shouldn't you know about his family? Like, why do you even need to, you know, make this clear to us? Unless, like, you know, it's for the audience's sake. You know, like, things like that can really gripe on me. It's really annoying when I notice it. Oh, another criticism I have. It feels like the combat is really wonky. I, I don't know why. It feels like I'm missing some of my attacks and, like, uh... Yoito is such a slow character, despite him having a katana. That is so weird. I, I don't know why that is. Just, I don't know. Maybe it's just the, the way this like uh, whole game feels. I, I don't know. Hopefully there's something in the settings that can like fix this, but I don't know. I, I just don't know. But these are just like uh, first thoughts for me. Maybe the game will get better as I, uh, as I keep playing. So anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this episode of Scarlet Nexus. If you did, please let me know in the comments if you want to see more of this Let's Play. I don't know how well received this will be as a Let's Play, you know? Especially with all the criticisms I'm giving so far. And be sure to subscribe if you have not already. And I promise you guys that this Ethereum will be around for the next episode. And as always guys, 